Assign a block to cross section template. Hello everybody. Welcome to video tutorial on how to assign blocks to cross section and change blocks for different set of sections. If you want to insert drawing blocks along with your cross section template, then in cross section template definition at a given point you can select the respective drawing file. When you apply the cross section template, eSurvey CAD will automatically insert the specified block at that point while creating cross section. For example, if you want to create an electric pole representation at road median, you can assign electric pole block to median point and the cross section will have electric pole block. How to apply different block to different cross sections? When a drawing block is defined in a cross section template, for all cross sections for which that template is applied, these blocks will be appearing. In some of the cases, it may require that we have to show different block. Say, in the above example, you want to show different electric pole for one stretch of only few sections. That can be achieved with an option called Edit Block in eSurvey CAD. Select Edit Block option from the cross section template or assembly menu to open the Edit Block screen. First of all, we have to let the program know that you wish to insert different blocks of a specific profile. This can be done by selecting a triple dotted button next to cross section template pull down. In set cross section template block window, select the cross section template for which you want to assign different block and click on set flag button which indicates that we wish to change the blocks for each section where this template is applied. Once we set the edit flag and close the window, in edit block variable window select the cross section template from the drop down and select the point at which you want to insert a block. Select from section and to section values and select the required block by clicking on triple dotted button. Update the record after you make all necessary selections. With these updates, you can see that different drawing blocks apply to different cross sections. Thank you for watching this video. In the next video, you will learn how to export cross section and print reports using eSurvey CAD.